All right, today I'm being a vegetarian and I am going to be making ramen noodles, chicken ramen noodles. You see this? Chicken flavored ramen noodles with cabbage and onions. All right, so let's get started. First, I'm going to put this to the side right here. And I have my pan heated up and I'm just going to add a little bit of olive oil to it. All right, just a little bit of olive oil in there. And once you have the olive oil and you heat the pan up, make sure that you spread the love around here a lot, okay? Once you spread the love, you're gonna wanna start to add uh, the ingredients, okay? First, we're gonna add onions. Let them saute a little bit, not all day, just a little bit. All right, added onions. And then I'm going to add the cabbage, all right? So I'm gonna add all this, and this is gonna keep on just sauteing, not all day, just a little bit, until it reaches absolute goodness, okay? So when it's in a pan, I'm gonna have a pan on to like medium, to medium, medium, all right? And I'm just gonna saute these a little bit, all right? Now I'm gonna do something, I do not recommend any of you do the outside. I do this because I am a professional chef, all right? I like to steam flash them, flash steam the ramen noodles. As you can see, this is starting to toast a little bit. Let me get in, zoom in close. You can see some of the toasteration happening. The toasting, you see that? The toasting is starting to turn around, which is great. All right, so I'm going to do that, let them toast. And then I am going to add the ramen noodles. Let me zoom out so you can see. I'm just adding the ramen noodles to it. These are ramen noodles that are cooked al dental. All right, so I'm gonna just let them toast a little bit. Meanwhile, while that's toasting, I'm gonna add about three quarters of the packet, maybe a whole, depending on my mood at the time, to on top of the ramen noodles, the chicken flavor. All right, so once I add that, I'm just gonna take it and stir it a little bit. Try to stir it up a little bit, and then do that, and they start to toast a little bit. Okay, now, do not do this at home. I'm doing this because I'm a professional chef. All right, I have a little bit of water. I'm just gonna toss some of it on top. And doing so, it's gonna allow the chicken flavor to actually penetrate the noodle. All right, and I'm gonna just keep on doing that, pour a little bit more water in it. Now, you don't want the noodles too wet, and you don't want them dry, okay? So once you do that, you stir it. I'm going to turn the fire off. Turn the fire off. All right. And then I'm going to take the ramen noodles. All right. Zoom back so you can see exactly what I'm doing. I'm going to take a bowl. I'm going to take the ramen noodles. And I'm going to put them in a bowl like this. Make sure you get the vegetables in there. Get the vegetables. Alright. Look at that. It's going to look good. The onions. The vegetables. Raymond, chicken flavor, absolute goodness. Now look at that. Look at that, all right? Now doesn't that look good? Absolute goodness, if you ask me. Absolute goodness.